dear listener welcome to my channel topic of this video is exercises on multiple linear regression using matrix inverse method in part 1 video equation for multiple linear regression is derived now let us start with the exercises using matrix inverse equation for multiple linear regression is beta cap is equal to x dash x inverse into x dash y example first x1 and x2 are independent variables y is dependent variable perform multiple linear regression calculate slope and intercept here in this program we require to find out beta 0 beta 1 beta 2 where beta 0 is intercept while beta 1 beta 2 are nothing but the slope or parameters of the multiple linear regression this example is given y is dependent variable where x1 and x2 are independent variable now first here we require to take the inverse of x dash x so first we arrange the matrix this is the input matrix here this first one indicates the intercept term and this is nothing but the matrix element 1 4 2 3 3 2 5 2 and 4 1 we take the transpose of the matrix that is x dash after that y is our output matrix which is represented as five rows and one columns then the next step is to take the inverse of x into x dash the inverse of x dash into x is this matrix first we multiply then we take the inverse and after that we are doing the multiplication of the inverse with transpose of x and again that resultant into the y so by this way we get the beta cap which is the column matrix in which three rows are there the first parameter with respect to beta 0 beta 1 and beta 2 only the concern is that it is very difficult in exam to calculate the inverse of the matrix now here for this problem the error is calculated and the simple error absolute error is calculated we can we can calculate the variety types of error form like mean square error and uh, mean absolute error but here only the error that is simple error is calculated now this is a, our equation and here we predict the parameter beta 0 beta 1 and beta 2 which is as 0.25 1.05 and 0.25 when put, when we put the value of x1 and x2 we are getting this answer for y cap so we can find out that the error is there between the actual value and predicted value the this is nothing but the way in which we can solve the multiple linear regression problem using matrix method let us start with the second problem here again x1 and x2 are independent variable y is dependent variable and here total records are 6 we require to calculate the slope and intercept that is nothing but beta 1 beta 2 and beta 0 respectively again we require to take the steps that is first we will take x here first column represents the intercept term then after that we can take the transpose that is x dash and y is nothing but the input column matrix that is the uh, whatever the values of the dependent variable so this is nothing but the 6 into 1 matrix first we multiply x into x dash and after that we will take the inverse so x dash into x and after that inverse of the x dash into x and after that we multiply this inverse matrix to x dash y and we will get the final matrix that is beta cap and here the three uh, parameters are there that is nothing but beta 0 beta 1 and beta 2 so in this way we can calculate the way is very simple but only the hurdle is that to calculate the matrix inverse now error is calculated again this is nothing but our predicted equation and we get the parameter 1.61 1.0 and 9.50 and here we are getting the this is the actual term and this is a predicted term and this is nothing but the simple absolute error so in this way we can solve the problem using the matrix inverse method for multiple linear regression the only uh, the difficulty in exam is to calculate the matrix inverse so in the next video we are solving the multiple linear regression problem by using the least square equation that is the curve fitting normal equation thank you